Hello beauties, it's Brittany. I'm on here to talk about some fashion things today. So a seller on Amazon reached out to me and asked if I would be willing to try some pieces uh, to review on my channel and I said yes because I have really been interested in trying Amazon clothing. For uh, me, I'm generally somebody who likes to be in the store, see the quality of the clothing, see how it fits on my body. So ordering online always makes me a little uh, skeptical and weary and a little worried about how it might fit or how it might look and things like that. So I wanted to show you the pieces that I got, tell you what size I um, ended up going with, if it worked, if it didn't work, um, and then kind of prices as well. And just so that you know, after I was sent the uh, pieces, I also ordered one on my own, which is the piece that I'm wearing today because I was so uh, thrilled with the quality and the uh, kind of fit on my body and I'm probably going to be ordering more very soon because I'm very very happy. I'm not 100% sure how to pronounce the uh, name of the clothing line. I will put it right here because I don't want to butcher it and I don't want to offend anybody by saying it incorrectly. Uh, this is the first piece that I chose. It is a white lace dress with kind of a silky uh, sash throughout the center here and then it has a tie in the back. So this is a size medium. I do really love it. I don't know if I will have an occasion to wear it right now um, just because white tends to be very bridal but maybe I can, maybe I can find a way to kind of make this uh, work for like Easter or something like that. I love lace pieces. I'm kind of obsessed with lace. I need to stop myself from buying like lace and mint all the time. I wanted to try a piece like this because this material is very, very delicate and I would recommend uh, dry cleaning. I have not washed this yet or washing it by hand if you feel like you need to. Uh, I do like this, but I feel like the sash kind of lays in a weird place. It's a little bit awkward, the placement of it. I wish it was like a little bit lower um, so that it was a little more flattering, but I do really love this. It's a very delicate, beautiful piece and the price range on these is really, really great, guys. This is the most expensive one and it retails for $25.99. So if you had, you know, a special occasion where you needed something delicate like this, but you didn't want to spend a whole lot of money on it, definitely check this out. See the photos in the reviews. Check out, you know, obviously the clips I'm going to show you of me wearing this piece. I did get a size medium. Just for reference, I always kind of wear a medium, sometimes very rarely a small, and I wear like a size 6 in jeans. The next piece I chose is the long sleeve off the shoulder knit pullover sweater. And so the way that it's photoed in the uh, post is that it's kind of an off the shoulder thing. I did wear it kind of on the shoulders just because I wore it to work and I felt like that was a little more uh, professional. But I did get a size medium in this one as well. My recommendation on this would be only get this if you're uh, short like I am. I have very short arms. I'm only 4'11", and uh, this is the only sweater that I think I have in my collection where the sleeve fits me perfectly. Uh, so if you're short, petite like I am, and you want a sweater that isn't kind of overbearing, this one is definitely very flattering. The sleeve length is perfect. It's not, you know, coming off of your hands and making it difficult to kind of do your everyday uh, things. Uh, I do really like this. The material is soft. It's not itchy, uh, so it does feel comfortable on the body. I also like the cinching at the bottom because I feel like it kind of pulls it all in and makes it look a lot more flattering as opposed to kind of being an overbearing sweater. I think uh, this might be my second favorite piece uh, with this one being my first favorite. This is the long sleeve tunic top casual basic shirt and I chose the shade black and I got a size medium and this is so soft so flattering I love the cut on the bottom it's kind of um, longer on the sides than it is in the center I feel like this clings to all the good parts of my body and stays away from the areas that I don't want to exaggerate or kind of enhance in any way this material is so so soft let me see if I can find a tag so this is rayon and spandex. I would definitely recommend uh, washing this one just in a delicate setting. I've washed it and I hung it dry. It stayed true to size and everything like that. So I wouldn't dry this just because it is such a soft material. I wouldn't want to um, have any shrinking or ruin the uh, softness of the material, uh, but definitely one of my favorite pieces. The sleeve on this I would consider uh, more of a normal sleeve, so if you're a little bit taller and you were worried about the pullover being way too short, um, I think that this one would be a good size for kind of average, average height people, unlike myself. And that tunic is super inexpensive at $9.99. 
And then the top that I purchased myself that I'm wearing is the is the long sleeve casual dress. I love the lace detail on the sleeve and it also has lace on the bottom which is so cute. And this one was really inexpensive at $11.99 and there were a few other colors available. This is the uh, wine shade which definitely leans a little more towards red uh, but I feel like I can definitely wear this and I generally do not like the shade red on myself just because it kind of clashes with my hair. But I feel like this is a very complimentary color. I really like the fit, but as you can see, the sleeves, you know, are a little bit long, but this is generally kind of what ends up happening for me because I do have such short arms, but it, you could easily kind of tuck it, um, you know, kind of pull it in and it doesn't uh, ruffle up too much where it looks overbearing or makes your arms look larger or anything like that. The lace detailing is so, so cute. I have washed this, I hung it dry uh, and it has still, you know, the lace still looks really beautiful. The lace on the bottom still looks really good. The material is still super, super soft. The material on this one and the uh, dress here are the same. They're the rayon spandex material. So, so soft. So, so soft. I am a really, really big fan. I think I'm definitely going to be ordering more in the future. I was looking through the shop and I found uh, this gorgeous jacket that I am really, really loving and I think that there's a beautiful variety. I have a sense that all of them are going to be similar quality. Obviously I cannot speak to that but I have four pieces here and I've been impressed with all four of them. Um, some pieces that I think that I'm going to add to my cart are the woman's v-neck pattern pocket maxi long dress and if it has pockets I'm definitely on board. I just need to look at the length because maxi dresses can be very long on me because I'm only 4'11 and then there's this double breasted long thin jacket trench coat uh, that I am definitely eyeing because it's super super adorable. I'll put images of those two items here on the side. Uh, so those are two that I'm kind of eyeing and I will have a 10% off coupon code for you guys listed in the information bar below as well as links to all of the pieces that I mentioned as well as the uh, shop homepage on Amazon so that you can check it out for yourself. I hope you guys enjoyed this video today and if you want to see more fashion kind of videos on my channel or more reviews of different brands that maybe you haven't heard of or more Amazon shops, let me know in the comments down below. I would definitely be interested in checking more out and I hope you all have a beautiful day and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye guys!